Hey friends, it's Tracy from HallofameMoms.com and it is time for another Frugal Friday video and this is just where I share some of the things that I'm doing that's just part of being part of my frugal life. Um, so I've been doing, uh, we've had to be frugal for years and years and um, we don't have it all down, you know, pat, like we, there's things that we need to still change and cut back and stuff, but um, I'm gonna today. I'm gonna talk about um, some frugal fam or um, frugal decorating. Um, since we're getting here to the end of the year, Christmas is this weekend, and after Christmas is when you're gonna want to get your um, decorations if you have money um, that you like to spend on that. Because the decorations are going to be dropping like 50 percent, 75 percent, maybe 90 percent um, at some of these places. Um, personally, this is how I have bought uh, decorations um, <clears throat> like over the past uh, years and then I can build up my supply um, so really I don't know that I, I don't know that I, there's anything I'm going to be buying um, this year after Christmas uh, the, there were some things that I wanted um, before Christmas and I purchased those at the dollar store so I'm going to talk, show you some of the frugal decorating things I just have some Christmas bulbs still hanging there. Um, this, this was just some garland somebody gave me. It was just the long, ropey stuff. I uh, doubled it up, wove it around my my curtain rod there, and then I hung or placed uh, the ornaments on there. I th and that bow came with the garland. It was kind of in pieces and I just put it put it back together and stuck it there and then uh, yeah so pretty much all of that is stuff I had and I'm thinking that the ornaments may have all come from the dollar store um, let's see what else down here is an old toolbox that I had and I just stuck some poinsettias in it and these poinsettias the only other thing I think are like these little sprigs I can just stick in there. Those poinsettias came from, uh, I think I got all those from Walmart after Christmas probably one year. So I probably got them for 50 or 75 percent off. Okay. And then if you can see up here, this, this is actually um, uh, like a garland rope. It had all the decorations in it except this right here. I made this. This is um, actually first let me talk about this. This long garland rope with the decorations. That was my sister's and we had a when we had a garage, a yard sale together we end up swapping each other's junk <laughs> so I got that for free from her. Then um, I had made this in the past. It's just like uh, I think on twine and dollar store ornaments these glitter kind and I have it hanging there oh well you can see that let's turn this on okay and then uh, these I got on sale um, at the at home store when I was doing a sponsored post they were on clearance I believe and it was a really good deal I think I got four or six of these for like 250 and I also got a bag of pine cones from at home um, and this was for a sponsored post that I had done and I'll link to that too so the, I actually received a gift card to help my purchase because um, I was doing a table um, decor post table setting post for them um, this is something that I made. I think I bought this old frame and then I'm thinking I bought it. I don't think I had it. But anyways, it was it was just wood and I painted it with leftover white paint that I had and bought this bobbly looking garland and um, I hot glued it back there. I have a how-to post I'll share. And then I, I bought, um, let's find it here. I bought this uh, lights, a string of lights from the dollar store. 
and oh, I can't really see it too well. Anyways, I I bought this string of lights from the dollar store for a dollar, and I just kind of hung it in there for the holiday season. And all right, let's go into the living room. Okay, so then here's my mantle. And you're going to see it's not perfect. You're going to see a cord stretched out right about there because that is where the outlet is. Um, so this was when I was trimming our, our live Christmas tree. I put the branches in um, just a jar of water and then I stuck some Dollar Tree. I think they're from the Dollar Tree. Um, snowflakes in there. I think this came from Walmart one year. And then I just did, um, I took something that I had, I think I actually got this at a thrift store, and I filled it with some bulbs. And then um, I just, you know, kind of scattered bulbs here and there, at, or just placed them to give them kind of a scattered look. Here's another one of my cheap poinsettias, poinsettias. A bowl of pine cones that seems to stay out year round um, that I've, I've I think I've just maybe had those. I think I got this guy from Walmart. And then um, our Christmas tree star, uh, for some reason, ended up in the wreath. Um, but I like it there. I don't think it was going to make it to the top of the tree. And that's a wreath I bought at a uh, garage sale. I think I paid maybe two bucks for it. And then here's our tree. I just put one of those Dollar Tree trees, I think it's from the Dollar Tree, up at the top. And um, just have garland and I didn't even put all our ornaments on it this year. I did stick some, I had some fluffy filler that wasn't getting used so I put that on the tree to help fill in some of the spots and give it more of a snow look. Let's see here. Try to give you a better look there. 